Hello, welcome back to our channel, Fairy Inspirational Hub. You can subscribe, like, share, comment, and turn on your notification bell so that you will get updated. Listen very carefully. Love has many characteristics. Love has many signs, as it were. There are many things you can look at and observe and predict or say that a person loves a person. But we're not going to all of them. Like the Bible says in Romans 1, the thing that we see physically helps us to understand the eternal things, even the Godhead. It means when you look at the things in this life, you are able to understand the things in the spirit realm. Are you following? I'm trying to be as simple as possible. That's why Jesus will come and say, the kingdom of God is like, are you getting what I'm saying? And he will be using physical things like farming, physical things like building a house. Because truly, if you observe the physical things, you can understand the what? The spiritual things. Many of us here know what it means to be in a relationship, to be in love. Two things you will notice love will do to you. Number one, it will take your time. Love will do what? It will take your time. Mama, the way you are nodding your head is as if you understand what I'm saying. You have experience. I'm tempted to give you the mic, if not for time. Because something is, something is making you say that. Love will do what? Take your time. People around you must think you are foolish. Ah, is somebody hear what I'm saying? Well wishers, friends and relatives, roommates must look at your love for that person and say, bro, wise up. Sister, take it easy. Oh. No be so. We are students. Oh. Because you will notice you are spending more time with the person you love than anything else. And what you will notice about spending time is that time will be flying. Yes or no? The way somebody shouted yes there is as if you have experience too. The days of extra cool are now over. But some of us who are old enough to remember know how four hours meant nothing. Did you notice that you didn't have to have anything important to say before starting the call? See, listen, you know, as you are laughing, pay attention. Did you notice that you did not have to react what you had to say? All you had to do was hear the voice, hello, and random nonsense for the next four hours are making sense to you, a mature man. You don't care about what anybody ate. What's your business with what people are eating? But your concern now is, is what this person ate. And what the person ate after that. And what the person ate after that. Do you fulfill destiny that way? I like that. Depending on who you are loving like that. Ah, did you catch what I just said? Though? All right. We did it, oh. I remember my father telling us it was a law do not do extra as far as I was concerned you can't even make heaven if you are doing extra cool how can you be wasting your life like that night after night tired during morning devotion because you are tired from call what were you talking about nothing but love will take your time i was saying you don't rehearse before you talk to someone you are in love with Love brings up discussions and everything makes sense. Do you know the Holy Spirit wants to hear every single little detail of your life? He's not interested in hearing only the serious things like when you are stranded and you need admission, like he got to my town and my twin brother had gotten admission and were twins which went out at the same time, yes or no? Because it would be very sad if they're asking your class and they're asking him his class and we're not in the same class. That's the only reason I wanted to enter school early. Because he had got to admission. Now, I knelt down and for the first time in my life, I said, Lord, if you give me admission, I will serve you until you beg me to stop. Now, thank God for prayers like that. 
where we talk to God when we need him but it's sad when your lover only hears your voice when you are in need tap your neighbor and ask your neighbor are you a Ron's girl if it's a man ask the man are you a Ron's guy that's what many believers are they are taking God to be a sugar daddy I don't know if you are hearing what I'm saying somebody you only collect things from ah, is somebody hear what i'm saying i want an army of lovers to arise from this meeting people who will vow name your price the way jesus told you ask and you shall be given you will tell him ask and it shall be given to you